First of all, there's, there's what I would call the wow factor. Um, and as you walk in, you, you get the feeling that something is different here. The facilities are amazing, and, and it's just that, that feeling that I am at some place special. When, when you walk into a, you know, a Fenway or a Wrigley or one of those places, you go, this is a special place. There are there, some pretty, pretty amazing facilities. Uh, the second thing is that great guest service. It is that Disney service. You know, as, as you sports parents, sports moms, sports dads, when you go to a place, imagine going to a sporting event and say, they're going to treat me at the sporting event like they get treated in the Magic Kingdom or at one of the Disney resorts. That's pretty special. And that Disney guest service, that Disney management for our events, it is something that's huge. The other thing is something that's near and dear to your heart is ESPN. Uh, we want to make sure that these kids feel like they've made it to the big time. And, and when they play here, they see the cameras, they see their highlights, they go back to their hotel room, see their games and highlights and clips on Channel 25 on the in-room TV. That's amazing. That, that is truly over the top. And then finally, we're at Disney World. I mean, there are great sports complexes all over the world, and we call it the Tom Brady effect. And no offense to those non-Patriots fans out there, but as Tom Brady wins the Super Bowl and says, I'm going to Disney World, that is what every one of these athletes gets to do every day. They finish their game, win or lose, and then they say, I'm going to head over to Magic Kingdom. And that's what's great. Youth sports is so important. And a lot of times, youth sports will get dinged for being, it's too much about the competition. It's too much. You know what? Here, this is about play. It is play on the field, and serious play on the field, but it's also play off the field, because at the end of the day, they're still kids, and we want to make sure they have a fantastic experience. And when you come to ESPN Wide World Sports, it is an experience at a whole other level. It is an experience where we can take care of box lunches delivered to your field, as opposed to, oh my gosh, they made it into the afternoon round, now I've got to run out to the local sandwich shop or the local fast food shop and try to pretend that it's a nutritious meal for the kids. Okay, we, we can have that nutritious meal delivered to you. We can have the photography taken care of for you. All those elements, uh, we have a lot of teams that travel from around the United States, they need boarding passes. Go to our Office Max business lounge, print out your boarding passes, charge your cell phone, do all those things that you can do. It's very well organized. Of course, it's in a beautiful location. Um, we're able to, um, because it's so well spaced out, so we're able to have family time, you know, go to the, go to uh, Disney World, hang out. Also, we have time, we come and we play our games. At, uh, looking at the schedule, you know, it's not just jam-packed. At some, some tournaments we have been to, we had like six games a day. That's crazy. So this is, you know, this is like a vacation, you know, wrapped into a, a playing basketball. It's one central location. Uh, all of the college coaches are here in one spot. Um, it's just the exposure of it being here at ESPN. It's one of those things that we know our goal at the end of the season is to be here. So we are prepared for it throughout the season with fundraisers. Plan in advance because uh, Nationals is, is the same time every year. So it doesn't sneak up on you. So that you're already prepared throughout your entire season. So do lots of fundraisers throughout your season to help, um, you know, also let the parents know to at least have it in their mind. Enjoy it and take in the experience and just have lots of fun.